So Ryan, who wouldn't want a second home slash maybe a vacation home in Arizona, especially this time of year? We're in November 2023, and we have a lot of people that ask us questions about the process to purchase a vacation slash second home. So let's talk with our audience about that topic today. Yeah, you know, it, it is snowbird season here in Arizona. And, and for those of you who don't know, that means people who live kind of in the colder areas up north come to Arizona for the warmer winter. We're all familiar with it out here in Arizona. And, and during this time, you know, vacation home purchases pick up significantly. So, I, you know, we wanted to take time during our Tip Tuesday to really discuss what a vacation home is and how it differs from an investment property. Now, if you want to purchase a home that you plan on exclusively renting out, you know, either a long-term lease or even an Airbnb, the minimum down payment is 20%. But if you're buying a home that you don't plan on renting out and you plan on living in that house throughout the year, like in Arizona during the winter, you know, it would be called a vacation home, or as you said, a second home. And on these properties, you only have to put 10% down. So it's half of that of an investment property. Now, there are restrictions to be aware of, you know, that you can only be a one unit property. You have to be able to occupy the home for some portion of the year, and it can't impact your employment and income. And, you know, there can't be any timeshare agreements, for instance, you know, on, on the home as well. So if you're looking to buy a home, you know, in a warmer client, uh, climate, and if Arizona is kind of what you're looking for, if you have any questions on it, let us know. It, it's a great product, and uh, it's very popular this time of year. Awesome. Yeah, it's beautiful here right now. It's like 70 degrees, you guys. So. <laughs> <laughs> and sunny. <laughs> yeah. Or if you like, want to do the other way around, if you're in Arizona and it's the summer and you want to go up north, that's a great time to buy a vacation home as well. <laughs> that's a really good point. And we're, we would love to educate you on the process before you get started on, on that. So let us know if you guys have any questions. Again, thank you guys for watching and uh, we'll see you next week. Bye. Bye, everyone.